let it go. Yeah. And when he was a little boy, about five, four or five years old, he, his mother worked at the beauty salon, and he'll be around there with a Mitch Mitch socks on and a broom in his hand, sweeping up the hair off the floor. And he used to love to do that. Yeah. <laughs> about four or five, you said. Yeah, he was about four or five years old, and he would walk around in the beauty salon. Oh, Lot of beauty salon. Oh yeah, I bought, him a, I bought him a save, teach him how to save money, how to put money aside. Ooh, you was about what, four or five years old? Older than that. Yeah, I went, went, bought him a safe. I used to try to teach him to value money. And if you're going to buy something, you buy this toothpaste and stuff, you need to invest in it. Right. Yeah, like how was he in school? In school he was pretty good. I think we had, I had one problem with him in school. He was going to Ross Elementary. And um. This little boy had some little almond figures because he did. He took the little boy's almond figure and I had to go in. He had to give it back. You remember that? Because he didn't have no reason to. Because his mama gave him everything that he possibly could want as a child. He used to fly, fly the airplanes by himself. Oh, he'd been a man ever since he was a little boy. About four or five years old, he's been a little man. It's a blessing from God, really. I think God's still working with it. In fact, I know he is. That's good. He's learned to be humble, appreciate it. And he loved his other grandmama too. She did a good job with it. She really did. Yeah. And so what books you think he was drawn to the most? I believe it was with uh, Frederick Douglass and this other book, I can't think of the man's name right now, but there were some books that he used to read all the time because it was bad books for him. Uh, what it takes to be a strong black man Oh, and who else you used to like to read Martin about? King. Oh, yeah, Martha, Dr. Martin Luther King. Malcolm Every, X. Yeah, everybody loves Malcolm X, but he Dr. would read those Dr. books. Dr. Malachi. Dr. Malachi, that was the main one. That's a good one. Malachi is Okay. Yeah, I got books right now. I wish you could go in there and get a picture, but you can't because they're going so messed up. I got books everywhere. Yes, sir. Oh, I like good. history. Yeah, like it sounds like you put him in a good a good place to be successful. It does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because books is, is always the key to knowledge. It is. It, I mean, it's so much information in those books. Oh, gosh. I wish you could look at it now, but if that room was messed up so bad, you can oh, see it. He, 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 he can't get that fever over there. Huh? The, the books. Yeah. No, he can't get well, that. He's not going to get the mess. Yeah, yeah, like I can just uh, get, the uh, get like a real close on the books. Yeah, like that the, way. See, I got I got clothes everywhere. Oh yeah, like I don't even you know, have to get, get the ground. I can just get the books. Okay, let me show you books. Uh, uh, you promise you're gonna get this? <laughs> no, I promise. I promise. I promise. I promise.